Close to Shore, The Terrifying Shark Attacks of 1916, written by Michael Capuzzo, is a riveting exploration of a series of shark attacks that occurred along the New Jersey coastline in 1916. This narrative non-fiction work delves into the gripping events surrounding the attacks and their impact on the public consciousness, while also examining the larger cultural and historical context of the time. The book is structured as a suspenseful narrative that chronicles the series of attacks, focusing on the lives of the victims, the response from local communities, and the growing fear that swept through the region. Capuzzo skillfully weaves together a cast of characters, both the victims and the people involved in the investigation and public reaction, allowing readers to connect with their stories on a personal level. By doing so, the author elicits empathy from the readers and effectively captures the emotional intensity of the events. One of the strengths of Capuzzo's writing lies in his ability to set the scene and immerse readers in the atmosphere of the early 20th century. Through vivid descriptions, he paints a picture of the coastal towns, the recreational activities of the time, and the societal norms that shaped people's lives. This contextual background not only enriches the narrative but also highlights the dramatic contrast between the peaceful, leisurely setting and the sudden terror brought by the shark attacks. This dichotomy emphasizes the shock and disbelief that gripped the communities and amplifies the horror of the incidents. Furthermore, Capuzzo delves into the collective psychology of fear and how it spreads like wildfire. He examines how these attacks shattered the illusion of safety in familiar waters, leading to a sense of vulnerability that resonated with the nation's anxieties during World War I. The book touches on the psychological impact of fear on individual and group behavior, showing how it drove people to take extreme measures, such as avoiding the ocean entirely or launching vigilante hunts for the sharks. The narrative is not limited to the attacks themselves, it also delves into the efforts to understand the motivations of the sharks and the science behind their behavior. Capuzzo introduces scientific perspectives of the time, effectively conveying the evolving understanding of sharks and their tendencies. This scientific discourse adds a layer of depth to the narrative, as it reflects the broader shift from fear and ignorance to knowledge and appreciation of these apex predators. Throughout the book, Capuzzo skillfully builds tension and suspense, leading to a climax that offers insights into the larger implications of the attacks. He examines how these events were instrumental in shaping public perception of sharks as ruthless killers, a stereotype that still persists today. The book prompts readers to reflect on the consequences of sensationalism and how the media's portrayal of these attacks influenced cultural attitudes toward sharks. In conclusion, Close to Shore, The Terrifying Shark Attacks of 1916 by Michael Capuzzo is a captivating work that skillfully combines historical research, personal stories, and thematic exploration. Through a meticulous narrative, the book not only recounts the harrowing events of the attacks but also delves into the psychological, scientific, and cultural dimensions that surrounded them. Capuzzo's evocative prose and attention to detail create an immersive experience that brings the past to life and prompts readers to consider the broader implications of fear, perception, and human interaction with the natural world.